Uh, my name is Lisa and I am an uncle firefighter at Tarpley. Um, I have three young children, eight, seven and five, um, and I manage the on-call around my children. I've been an on-call firefighter since 2017, so just over 18 months. Um, I live with my three children. Um, family life is very much centred around the three children, school, after school clubs, parties, um, things like that, days out. Um, my inspiration for wanting to become a firefighter, um, I think it wasn't really something that was always in my life plan. I, you know, I grew up thinking this is what I want to do, but I did have um, a time when my youngest child was, um, was very poorly and needed a, a life-saving operation. Um, he was he's absolutely fine, um, but we were helped by a team of, uh, of people, a team of professionals, a team, team of, a team of trained professionals. Um, and from that moment onwards, I had wanted to do something, but wasn't quite sure what that would be. That you know was part of working with a team that would would help people. When the fire service came to the school to do their recruitment drive, I think everything just married up, and that was it. That's what, that was what, what, what I wanted to do. Um, I'm usually on call when the kids are at school or on a weekend, um, so there isn't really a huge impact. I don't feel like I'm missing out on anything because that's time that I would be giving to to the job or whatever anyway because being a, being a stay at home mum is my other mm. job if you've got another job then you just manage the two around each other I am at contracted to a minimum of 50 hours a week which might sound like a lot however some of those hours are when I'm asleep so obviously I wouldn't you know, necessarily even notice that I'm uh, that I'm caught on call some of those hours um, I'm at home I'm a stay at home mum for three young children as I said so I'd be doing things in preparation for them coming home from school or you know normal stay-at-home mum things some of those hours are on a weekend so actually that 50 hours breaks down it's very manageable chunks um, and doesn't become you know that large amount of hours anyway I had a lot of perceptions about the fire service that were completely unfounded really I'd assumed um, wrongly that they were mostly looking for, for males um, very possibly males who were a lot younger than me, um, that they wouldn't really be interested in a 42-year-old stay-at-home mum of three. Um, but I was wrong. Uh, they were looking for the qualities that you have, um, as opposed to you know, your height or your age, uh, or even your sex. Life as an on-call firefighter, from my perspective, is, uh, is something that I absolutely love, um, to be honest. Um, every day is different. Um, every day I'm going to do something that I know is going to benefit somebody else, which is, which is what I signed up to do, whether it be something tiny or whether it be something on a larger scale, you know, I'm helping somebody. Um, it is, um, you've got to commit to things like drill night, um, which is once a week, but again, you know, I enjoy that, you're learning something and every week is different. Um, so yeah, I, I wouldn't change anything, I love it.